this is Xiang Zhang. I'm a junior student in mechanical engineering of University of Michigan. I'm currently doing traffic flow research through SHORE program, which is summer undergraduate research in engineering of University of Michigan. With the help of Professor Gaber and PhD student Mubin Adeline Jun. As we know, driving is a very common and necessary tool nowadays. And uh, also, in, uh, my, I choose this project since my dream is making driving safety and easy. Imagine you can drink a cup of coffee or read newspaper when driving and let the car go itself. Though not realistic so far. And uh, so, my current research is about how to improve autonomous cruise control system by adding wireless communication between two cars that may have some other cars between them. The reason we do this is that we found time delays may influence the stability of cruise control system. And as time delay increases, the stability may lose. It means your car may hit the car in front of you without human control. So my aim is to find the control gains that can help the stability of the cruise control system. OK. So I would like to introduce about how I did this project this summer. My favorite friend is this computer. And, but before that, we need to write something down. So here is a three cars model, you see that. Uh, I would like to introduce, this is motif two, since this is the first motif that has the wireless communication. Since we do not need wireless communication if there are only two cars here. You see, the wireless communication can send the information of the, the speed information of the leader to the follower, which cannot be done by the reader. The reader can only transfer information between the car just in front of you and your car. And I build a mass model, saw this in the time domain, and then we got the solutions. And uh, also, if we want to analyze this control system, we need to linearize it. And then we got A matrix, which connected with state variables. And the B matrix connects the state variables and the input. Also, C matrix connects the state variables and output. You see here is a one here. It means we want to know the speed information of the bar. Okay, so if you finish this, you can turn on the maple. And put the matrix into maple. Here is the A matrix, B matrix, C matrix. Okay, so we want to know two kinds of Stability. The first one is plant stability, which means that you can follow a car that does not have change of speed. And also the string stability, it means that you can follow a car that has some vibration of speed. So we need to test them to ensure that our control gains satisfy our requirements. So firstly, we calculate the determination of the matrix, A matrix. But multiply here the A matrix is not that A matrix I showed you just uh, in the PDF. Since this is Z times the identity matrix minus A matrix, and we need to calculate this determination to determine the plant stability. So then we calculate the plant stability boundaries which means that here there are three plant stability boundary that determine the plant stability conditions. And continuing for stream stability, we need to show, I need to show you that here, you see, it's a matrix uh, multiply. We need to multiply C times inverse of A and uh, times the B matrix, then we got 
does change the bidding condition of this CPU. It's very complicated, so it almost uh, it almost uh, no one can calculate it by hand unless you want to try it. Okay, so here I will open another software, which is MATLAB. And the MATLAB we use a very useful tool which is called DDE Big Tool. And here we put the equations of string stability boundary here. And here we put the starting point here. And then here is a step length we need to give this to the viewer so that we can find the solutions by itself. Then we hit the run. You see it traces the calculation method. Okay, so now we draw one curve here. I don't know. For really stability chart, there are so many curves here. So we need to run it many, many times for just one stability chart. So here is one. The, here is one example of the stability chart when the time delay is equal to 0.5. 